Greetings everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's video I'm gonna show you how to apply on our video clip a very interesting paint effect. This effect can be accessed in the separate menu on, in the Power Director. Open the Plugins menu and click on the AI Style Effect Plugin menu. There are four styles available in the Style Plugin window. The Impressionist, the Chinese Traditional Paintings, the Minute and Monet style, and the last, the Vincent van Gogh style. To use one of the styles, click the appropriate download button. I will use the Impressionist, so I click on download button now. The application manager window appears. Select the effect pack tabs on the left. Then set a filter to show only plugins designed for PowerDirector and only the non-installed packages. Otherwise, we could search in a very long list. Finally, arrange each packs in alphabetical order. Use the scroll bar on the right side to find the names starting with the letter I. There are also two impressionist packages install but Click the volume 1 installer button. After downloading, the effect is installed automatically. Click the download button for volume 2. After a long download, the second package is also installed automatically. Switch to the My Programs tab in the left panel and start the PowerDirect on application. I'm importing the video clip I want to change, so in the File menu select Import and then click on Media File. Finding the clip on disk I import it, drag the imported clip onto the timeline. Let's take a look at the video clip. Now open the AI style plugin via the plugins menu. As you can see some impressionist effects are now available. I think one of the volumes also installed the minute and monet effects, no problem. Import our media file, click on the import button here and select import from media room option. Choose our clip. The screen on the right shows what the video will look like. We can choose the effect that suits us best from the left panel. For me, painting for works best in this case. Turn on hardware acceleration and play the video. As you can see, real-time playback doesn't have any hardware power either. So let's start the video transformation. The effect transformation process takes some time. When done, the new video clip will appear in the media room. I'm deleting the old clip from the video track and drag the new clip onto the timeline. Let's take a brief look at what the result looks like. Awesome! The Power Director team did a good job. The work of the AI is very impressive. So thanks for watching, if you like this video make sure to subscribe for more and see you in the next time. Bye!